In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys every service that you can disable inside Windows to lower your processes and boost your FPS in game. So without wasting any time, let's get into the video. So the first thing you're going to want to do is click the Windows key and type in services and open this up. And everything we're going to be disabling is inside here so we can lower our processes and boost our FPS in game. First one you're going to want to disable is auto time zone update. So to disable this, you just double click drop this menu down, click disabled, click apply and make sure the service is stopped. If it's on start, you just want to click the stop button so it stops running Then you click OK. And that is how you disable one of the services inside here. The next one we're going to be disabling is the AVCTP service. So double click, make sure it's disabled. The next service is going to be the background intelligent transfer service. So double click, make sure it's disabled. Then or just underneath that, you'll see BitLocker drive encryption service. Make sure this is disabled then bluetooth audio gateway service make sure this is disabled and bluetooth support service just underneath this then if you click c and go down to clipboard service make sure this is disabled then if you click d on your keyboard make sure this data sharing service and data usage is disabled then if you click g on the keyboard you see geolocation service right here make sure this is disabled then just underneath that if you have chrome on your pc you want to disable the Google Chrome Elevation service. Before we continue disabling the services, I want to let you guys know this video is sponsored by Risen Tweaks. Risen Tweaks is an optimization service that offers all of these different packages for super cheap prices. If you guys want to use these and use code Ruffy when you check out, you get 15% off, so you get the tweaks for even cheaper. And I use these extreme tweaks right here. On a stock Windows, I was getting about 200 FPS, and after using these, I was getting over 400 FPS. So I definitely recommend going and checking them out. I'll leave the link in the description. And if you are purchasing, make sure remember use code Ruffy so you can save money on your order. But back to disabling the services. The next ones we're going to be disabling is the internet connection sharing service, which is this one right here. And then underneath that, the IP helper. Make sure you disable this. Then if we scroll down to net.tcp port sharing service, make sure this is disabled. This can really improve your ping in game. So I definitely recommend disabling this one. Then if you click O on your keyboard, you'll find offline files. Make sure this is disabled. And then the service underneath this, open SSH authentication agent. Make sure this is disabled as well. Parental controls, just underneath that, make sure this is disabled. Phone service, make sure this is disabled. Print spooler, make sure this is disabled. Then if you click W on the keyboard, make sure the wallet service is disabled. Then if you click X, you'll come down to all these Xbox services. Make sure all of these are disabled. Once you've done that, you can close off the services. And those are all of the services that you can disable inside Windows to boost your FPS and get the minimal amount of processes possible. That is going to be it for this video guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. If you do want to go check out Risen Tweaks, I'll leave the link in the description. But thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.